This is ah, come on in. I've got something to show you. Huh. They started appearing all over the tower ever since that crow man arrived. First off, I thought they were like big oranges, then football balls, but now I reckon I've worked out what it is. Hey, hey, snuggle feet, most comfortabulous. <laughs> ah, it's the unfortunates. <whistles> ah, up they come, up to the tower. I hope they're feeling brave. Six floors of misery, ransomation, and untold doom. This batch of unfortunates are from Glasgow. There's Daniel, who has a fear of frisbees. Chloe, who's a pirate. Weekends only. James, he's a professional karaoke king. That's Carly. She's a member of the royal family. Jack, who used to be a moustache. And Darcy is from London. How did she get in there? In they go. <laughs> this is my watch tank. This is where I get to see everything that goes on in the tower. For years, bobbing craftful of unfortunates have been coming to the tower. <laughs> Imprisoned at the top, they work to pass the challenges and escape each floor. For each challenge, a new saboteur is chosen. You are the saboteur. Only one will escape with the key of freedom. And the rest remain trapped. <laughs> Floor six, giant appetite. <laughs> ha! Let's hope the unfortunates haven't bitten off more than they can chew. A hungry giant is waiting for his guzzle snacks. To pass this challenge, the unfortunates must set his banqueting table with the correct items in place. If they hear the giant coming, they must hide quick. But watch out, as someone will be trying to spoil the party. If the table is not set when the time runs out, they will fail. Fee, fi, fo, fo! Listen to the rumble of the giant's tongue. <laughs> Sorry, oh, I got that carried away. Who is the one who can't be trusted? It's time to pick the saboteur. Jack, do not react. You are the saboteur. You are the only one who can hear my voice. And the only one who knows that the giant does not exist. When the others are hiding, come out and destroy the banquet. I will guide you through your whisper clip. It's Jack. If he fails, he'll be trapped on the top floor. Unfortunates. This is giant appetite. To pass... You must have the banquet table laid at the end of two minutes. Let the challenge begin now! Okay, Jack. Looks like you're helping the others. Come on, work quickly. Of course, there is no giant. It's you! And you will destroy the banquet. Hi, now! Remember... The others mustn't see or hear you. Wait! Off you go. Yes! Wreck as much as you can! <laughs> now get back to your hiding place! Out you come! Help the others! Next time, push things off at the other end of the table. You don't want the food near you. Oh, there's a check. Watch, get the chicken in the back. Chicken in the back. He's coming. Come on, hurry. Hide quickly. Don't be the last one in. 60 seconds. Off you go. Down to the other end of the table. That's it. Go on. Yes. Hide quickly. <laughs> Out you come. Work with the others. Get the table set. Come on. Here. They're working fast, but don't worry. You have one more chance to really go for it. Who's got the chicken? seconds. Here he comes. Come on, Jack. 
Don't be the last in. You can't afford to look suspicious. Out now. Do as much damage as you can. Brilliant! Yes. Nine, nine, Hide. Eight, seven, six, five, Quickly! Four, out you come! Three, two, one. Your time is up. You have failed miserably. I think that all went rather well. All did it. You must now vote for who you think the saboteur was. Carly, who do you think the saboteur was and why? I think it was Jack because he was really slow getting in and he was really slow going that side. Jack, who do you think the saboteur was? I think the saboteur was Carly because I heard her run past me and she seemed to be coming out last. Darcy. I think it was Daniel because when the food came tumbling over our heads. I, he, it was always from his direction. Daniel. I think the saboteur was Jack, because the first piece of food that, fi uh, that fell on the floor was over his head. Chloe. I thought it was Daniel because I was, like, laughing all the time. James. Who do you think the saboteur was? I think it was Jack, because I saw his foot when I was crawling out the table. You have voted for Jack. I can now reveal the saboteur was, in fact, Jack. <laughs> Jack, although you sabotaged the challenge, you were detected. Therefore, you will not be leaving this room. The others are free to pass to the next floor. Oh, so, a successful sabotage, but not quite sneaky enough to succeed. <laughs> Jack, why do you think you failed as a saboteur? I think I failed because the others heard me when I was running around pushing the food off the table. Poor, unfortunate Jack. You're trapped! <laughs> oh, let's hope the next saboteur's more crafty than Jack. Floor five! Where the crow man. A wrong move in this challenge could blow it all! A murky meadow where a crow man guards 13 flickering pumpkins. To pass this challenge, the unfortunates must sneak past him and blow out three pumpkins. But beware, some of the pumpkins are bad and will disturb the crow man. Blow out three bad pumpkins and they will fail. It's time to pick the saboteur! Chloe, do not react. You are the saboteur. It is your job to ensure your team fail this challenge. You must use your powers of persuasion. Get the others to choose pumpkins with teeth. These will wake the crow man. Don't be too obvious. I will guide you through your whisper clip. Rather her than me! Unfortunates! This is Beware the Crow Man. To pass, you must blow out three pumpkins without waking the Crow Man. Let the challenge begin now! Chloe, any pumpkin with teeth. Okay, cool. They may be doing for colours, so yeah. think of the colour choices. Colour says... I'd go for the white. Good. There's yeah, only one white. I yes, it's, it's got teeth. Okay. Let's go for the white. All right, for white. Go. Yeah. yeah, you go. go. You go. Brilliant. Just wait. <laughs> <laughs> you must speak up, Chloe. They think it's about colours. Okay. So any pumpkin with teeth. No, you don't go for yellow either. Just. Um, no. Uh, what about that big green, green pepper one? Yeah, yeah. agreed. So so yellow. Yeah. Maybe it's not yellow. Come on, get in yeah. there. Yeah, yeah. 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 Been lucky so far. One more, and you've done it. Go for the orange and black one. The orange and black one. Yeah, it no, it has teeth. Yeah, well, well but it's completely one. different. I like the orange. Don't let them talk yeah, over you. Yeah, go for the purple it's really one. Close to it. Yeah. What about the what? purple one? Let's go for the orange. But that's good. That gives you a kind of They're not listening. Get in there. What about the purple? You do it.
Oh, too late! You can't afford to hang back, Loey. They trust Orange. The purple one has an orange top. Orange one? Yeah, the big one. Yeah, the big one. Yeah. Yeah. You go. You go for the big one. Come on, speak up. What about the purple? Chloe, this is dangerous. You can't let them get another good pumpkin. Oh, there's one more orange one down there. Yeah, orange is again. Again. None of the orange ones have teeth. Oh, wait, there's, there's, there's another orange one. Yeah. Purple has an orange top. I've gone to oranges and no, the two. Like, wait, wait, come on. Is that team? No, yeah. what about the purple right. one? No, the red hand. You must do something. Well, for the sofa. Do the white one at the front. Yes. Do the white one at the front. Orange? Yes. White's that pure colour. You've lost it. Yes. Your time is up. You have passed. Oh, what were they thinking? You have passed. Therefore, the saboteur is automatically locked in the room. But before I reveal the unlucky unfortunate, who do you think the saboteur was and why? Daniel, who do you think the saboteur was? I thought it was Chloe because when we all picked the orange one apart from Chloe and she was trying to change her mind. Chloe. I thought it was Daniel because he was just disagreeing with us about what one to go with. James. I think it was Chloe because she was always disagreeing, especially on the last one when we were right. Carly. I think it was Chloe because she only agreed with us when it was a wrong pumpkin and she didn't agree with us with the right one so it sounded a bit fishy. Darcy. I think it was Chloe because at the beginning she was really quiet, but then in the end when we made a decision she was disagreeing with us completely. You have voted for Chloe. I can now reveal the saboteur was in fact... Chloe. Chloe, you failed to sabotage the challenge and you were detected. Therefore, you will not be leaving this room. The others are free to pass to the next floor. So, a bad saboteur, and even worse, a being sneaky. <laughs> Chloe, how do you feel about being trapped? It's quite scary because I'm with the cruel man. Poor, unfortunate Chloe. Ah. He's creepy. You're trapped! <laughs> <laughs> Poor Chloe. Two down, three to go. Nothing worse than a snake biting an unfortunate, and that's a snake not biting an unfortunate. Ah. Darcy, do not react. You are the saboteur. It is your job to ensure your team fail this challenge. I will tell you where the snake is. Use your powers of persuasion, but careful. You don't want to be detected. I will guide you through your whisper clip. Can Darcy master the art of sabotage? See what they uh, say. Let's try and go to the middle because it, you would, it, it would expect I'll you to go to the top. Let's go. I think top. I'd go Agree. to the middle. But if I'll you want to go for top, go for top. Yeah, because it's your choice. No, but because it's yours. Yeah, is that fine? We're just, we're just, just giving suggestions. We're just giving suggestions. Just, just, giving suggestions. just go for top. Yeah, done. Go on. Brilliant. Bite, bite. <laughs> It's in the top this time. Next one. Okay. It's not going to be in the top one again. It must be in one in the middle or the bottom one. No, but it may be Clever. in the top one. Clever. It may not be in the top one, I mean. Because it... OK, what should we go for, then? Go for the top one again. I'd go for the top one again. Yeah, the top one again. Because it yeah, probably would be one in the middle. Yeah, yeah, I'd go for, yeah, the, go for the game. I'd go for it. Here he comes! <laughs> The snake okay, is in the middle. Top again. I don't think we should go for uh, the okay. top. No, Agree. Top again. If you do go for the top Definitely again. Definitely not top. Right. I, I think, I think, I think middle. bottom. I think, I think middle. Stick with Carly. Okay. Okay. I'll just go with Carly on this one. Bottom middle. middle. Yeah, yeah, middle. I'd go with bottom. Oh, no, i got a feeling it's in the middle. But I'm Careful. I've got a feeling it's not in yeah. the bottom. That's it. I don't be too bottom. obvious. Yeah. All right, oh, yeah, let's go for bottom. Okay, go for bottom. Yeah, because you never know. Okay, you can let them have this. You have two more chances. Right. The snake is in the top. Okay. I'd go for the middle this time, because we're not... No, top! What do you say, Carly? Well, have we done middle yet? 
No, we've done two tops and one bottom, so let's try middle. No! Yeah. Right, what do you say, middle? Yeah, middle. middle. You're being too risky. If you let them get this, you must get the snake next time. Yes. Get this or you're trapped! Um, it's in the bottom. Bottom. Well, but bottom. bottom was good, wasn't it? Uh, yes. Yeah, only two good ones. I've got oh, a about we've the done bottom. top twice and both of them were... Why not the bottom? Why not the bottom? Not bottom. I'm not, I'm going for bottom. Why not? Why? Don't let James decide. It's not going to be bottom. It's not going to be bottom. Why? It won't be top. Right, top. No! Say something! We've got to decide as a team. Stop him! Stop! Yes! You have passed. Oh, I can't watch! Actually, I can. You have passed. Therefore, the saboteur is automatically locked in the room. But before I reveal the unlucky unfortunate, who do you think the saboteur was and why? James, who do you think the saboteur was? I think the saboteur was Darcy because at the last one she disagreed when we got it right. Carly. I think it was Daniel because it just didn't seem right. Darcy. I think it was Daniel because at the beginning he just agreed with all the things we did and the decisions we made were wrong and at the end he just didn't say anything. Daniel, who do you think the saboteur was? I think the saboteur was Darcy because she was quiet the whole way through the game and at the very end she didn't seem very happy when we passed. You have voted for Daniel and Darcy. I can now reveal the saboteur was, in fact, Darcy. Darcy, you failed to sabotage the challenge. Therefore, you will not be leaving this room. The others are free to pass to the next floor. No, oh, not quite cunning enough to get away with it. Darcy. Why do you think you failed as a saboteur? I thought I was really convincing up to the last hole when I just mucked it up. Poor unfortunate Darcy. You're trapped. <laughs> Darcy tried to play a sneaky one, but there's no room for slip-ups when you're a saboteur. Floor three. Forbidden chambers. Ooh, stinky plots and snarty pants. It's them smelly jub-jubs. <laughs> In the forbidden chambers are crates of smelly jub-jubs that must be kept apart. To pass this challenge, the unfortunates must stack the crates of the same colour in the matching coloured chamber. But they can only carry one colour at a time and can only enter another chamber if it is unoccupied. If less than two towers are stacked, when the time runs out, they will fail. There's only three, so who will it be? It's time to pick the saboteur. Carly, do not react. You are the saboteur. It is your job to ensure your team fail this challenge. You can do this by mixing up the colored crates lying to your team and making sure they do not stack two towers by the end of two minutes. I will guide you through your whisper clip. Ah, Carly! She'll need stacks of cunning to make the team fail. Unfortunate. This is Forbidden Chambers. To pass, you must have at least two towers complete at the end of two minutes. Let the challenge begin now! Carly, don't let them complete two stacks of crates. There's an orange! I an orange! That's it. Just keep mixing the colours. Don't forget to talk. Where are you going? Not the purple. Green. That's it. And take it into the purple room. There's in there. Me. I'm just going. Don't be too quiet or they'll suspect you. Is that you? you must sound like you're part of the team. Come on, talk to the others. OK, I'm on the green room. Yes. Green. I've got Let me in the green room, Carly. Oh, they've both got greens. Say you're stuck. Let me in. Look at me, come on. James is in the purple now. You can't move. Me, I've got 
three green Marley lemon the green. Stop locking me. Come on, oh, get James to move. I'm the... James, James, stop locking me. James, are you in the orange? <laughs> no, I'm in the purple. I'm, I'm in the orange. The orange is me. I need that. I've got three greens. Now oh, Daniel's James telling James to move. James, what are you doing in there? It come sounds come like James yellow. is blocking everyone. Not yet. Come James, on, Carly, keep mixing up the coloured crates. Hi. What are you doing? You've just I'm taken a purple, purple crate into the purple room. Get them out. Carly, you're in the purple. Yeah, I'm in the purple. Get the three green boxes up okay. again for you. 30 seconds. If you do that, they'll complete green. Daniel has the other two. Take the purple crates and go into the orange room. Come on! Oh, too slow! God. James has beaten you to it! Using the yellow! And he only needs one more orange! I, I've got two yellows, I think. Yeah. Keep it up, Carly! James! Ten, what are you doing? Nine, eight, Let seven, me in the orange! Six. Where'd they Brilliant! The this is a disaster three, for your team! Two, <laughs> <one>. <laughs> Your time is up. You have failed miserably. Oh, nicely done. But has the saboteur been spotted? Unfortunate. You have failed miserably. Therefore, the saboteur has succeeded. But have they remained undetected? You must now vote for who you think the saboteur was. Carly. Who do you think the saboteur was, and why? I think it was James, because he, he kept on not moving, and I just didn't know what to do, and I kept on going to get confused. James. I think the saboteur was Carly, because she wasn't doing a lot of shouting. Daniel, who do you think the saboteur was? I think the saboteur was James, because near the end, uh, he was being so slow, he was trying to get in the orange room, saying there was someone in it, but there was no one in the orange room. You have voted for... James. I can now reveal the saboteur was, in fact... Carly. James, you will not be leaving this room. The others are free to pass to the next floor. That's how to play the game! James, why do you think the others voted for you? I think the others voted for me because um, I was trapped in the rooms all the time and I couldn't get in and out. Poor unfortunate James. You're trapped! <laughs> Poor James, framed good and proper by clever Carly. Floor two. One way out, and there can only be one winner. It's the fight for freedom. To win the key of freedom, unfortunates must answer questions on their time in the tower. It's simple. Win, and they'll escape. Lose, and they'll be trapped. <gasps> I'm so excited. A little bit sick came up. Unfortunates. This is your fight for freedom. The unfortunate with the most correct answers will be the winner. You have 60 seconds to prove yourself. Let the challenge begin now! Carly, who was trapped with the crow man? Chloe. Correct. Daniel, who were you setting the table for on floor six? The giant. Correct. Carly. How many pumpkins did you blow out on floor five? Um, five. Correct. Daniel, name an unfortunate who didn't make it to floor three. Jack. Correct. Carly, what was the colour of the crow man's hat? Blue. Incorrect. Purple. Daniel, what was on top of the giant's cupcakes? Cherry. Correct. Carly, name a room colour in Forbidden Chambers. Orange. Correct. Daniel, on floor three, how many different colours could you move at once? One. Correct. Carly, what colour was the snake's venom? Black. Correct. Daniel, how many statues were in the room with the giant's table? Two. Correct. 
Carly, what was the color of the last pumpkin you chose? Orange. Correct. Daniel, which unfortunate got trapped with giant food? Jack. Correct. Daniel and Carly, your time is up. Daniel, you answered six questions correctly. Carly, you answered five questions correctly. Daniel, you are the winner. Congratulations. Carly, how do you feel about being trapped? Um, I'm a bit disappointed, but I'm glad I got this far. Poor, unfortunate Carly. You're trapped! Daniel, you have won your freedom. Take the key and leave the tower before I change my mind! See you first! Ah, so, with that key, Daniel is free. Now, I might have confuddled you a lot before by using these pumpkins as snuggle feet. Don't be listening to Caretaker on that, because these things are actually for chilling out. Oh, <laughs> yes. There you go. <sighs> right! Scram! Well, you wouldn't want to get trapped. The world of celebrity. Glamorous. Exciting, fun, but what about the stars behind the stars? We make sure that we all know what we're doing and that we feel comfortable and that we don't hurt ourselves. Without all the coaches that we have, not like one of us would be the players that we are. We set them challenges at early ages. Well done. He's actually watching what we're doing and yeah. creating it to make it sound like one. CBBC meets the VIP people who make it happen. That's a Starts Monday at 4.30 on the CBBC channel.